Hey everyone, it's Janice Speedy here, and I'm going to show you how to add uh, new tracks to Ender 2003, uh, add mods or other kinds of cars uh, to Ender 2003, and how to add uh, cars to those um, new mods. So you can go and race your own custom cars and everything. Uh, just to give you a little heads up, this uh, is kind of meant for people who have never had Ender 2003 and don't know how to add mods or tracks to the game. Uh, so if you don't have Ender 2003, um, I take a look at the video, it'll just be up in the top uh, right hand beside the little eye, and that should give you a link to how to get to, uh, Ender 2003 there. Uh, but like I said, this, this tutorial is more meant for people who have just finished that video and are looking for like the next step in you know, adding stuff to Ender 2003. Uh, so the start will add in mods. Um, it's all very simple how to do this. Uh, first you'll just have to find a mod you want to get. Uh, I'm going to take the um, NASCAR Craftsman Truck Series uh, 2009 mod. Uh, so we'll take that. And then what we're going to do here, we're going to go into our Papyrus folder in our 2003. And then we're going to select the Series folder. By default, you should have Cup as the only one that's in there. I've already added the COT mod, as you may have seen from some of my older videos. Uh, all you do is you simply add that in there. And then that will allow you to uh, get that mod there. So we'll just open up NR2003 here. So what you will notice here is the start is at the bottom here. I'm actually just going to go ahead and get this adjusted a bit, I think, here. Give me one moment. So you'll see here at the bottom. you'll now have active series and you can actually change between series. Uh, so the one we just added here is going to be a little bit slow. Uh, it's because that's loaded all up. And now we have the truck series. And then from here, uh, you'll want to select um, what truck you want to use. Uh, this is just uh, essentially a copy of uh, the one that's using for the league that I used to run. Uh, so there's a lot of uh, trucks in here already that um, people in the league had run already. But essentially, you can go and select the car you'd like to use. And then you can also select uh, what, track, what truck you'd like to use when you're racing in multiplayer. Uh, so that's what you can do for that. And then that's essentially how you would get uh, a mod into um, and our 2003. And like I said, the mods can be in all kind of different, can be all sorts of different things. Um, you know, like I said, there's trucks, you know, you got the car tomorrow, you got the regular cut, but there's all sorts of different ones. Uh, there's like sprint cars, um, you know, 80s cars and 90s cars, all sorts of different cars. Uh, so definitely go out there, you can just Google search to find which ones you want to look for. Um, you know, I'll leave that up to you to find out where to find them. I will have a link for this one though in uh, the description. Uh, that's how you add mods. Um, now if you're looking to add uh, your own custom uh, trucks or if you go and download you know your own custom car set or something because uh, there are car sets and stuff out there. How you would go and add those is uh, you'll go into your series, open up the mod that you got the cards for, open up the cars folder and then paste it in to uh, this folder. Uh, so if that's the trucks, that's where we put the trucks. If we got like a default cup series, we can go and put it in here. Um, if we got a COT car, then go into the COT series. So that's how you would go and add in your cars. And then the next thing we will do here is we will add in tracks. So the track we'll add in here will be our 
Talladega track we ran at FORL. So for that, I uh, just open up the tracks folder and paste it in. Super simple. Um, I believe this will show the first 128 tracks in and it will go uh, based in alphabetical order. Uh, so like for most people, Watkins Glen will be the first one that will eventually get uh, overridden and removed. Uh, so just be aware of that, you know, depending on the naming, depends on how far down the track will be overridden. And I'll show we have that track in there now. Just open up NM2003 again. Uh, for the heck of it, we'll go in the truck series. And if we go down here, we have Taldega. And like I said, there are hundreds to thousands of tracks out there. So I'll let you kind of figure out where the tr what tracks you want to get and where to find them. Uh, but that's just kind of a basic tutorial on how to get tracks and such uh, for under 2003. For those who you know, have just got the game and want to get the most out of the game, uh, that's what you'd want to do. Uh, if you have any questions or anything like that, go ahead and post them in the comments below. Uh, and also, if you find this helpful at all, or if you want more information on this kind of stuff, uh, give it a subscribe. Uh, you know, gives you an update of when uh, the next video comes out for the next time you could use the, you know hand finding out what you need to do in the game. Thank you guys uh, so much for watching, and I will see you guys next week.